guys, and you're back with another episode of my Let's Play. This will be episode 6, and I just thought I'd show you two things I've been working on recently. One of which is now finished, and just needs expanding because it's stackable, and works really quite nicely. And the other one I'm currently building, and we'll be doing that this episode. So the first thing is, I've got a cactus farm. Yeah, this is what we're working on. It's cactus farm, it's not that hard, it's really quite simple. Um, it doesn't generate very many cactuses now at the moment, cacti. I've got a little item disposal here. But yeah, it does what I need it to, and it makes cactus for me. Which at the moment I don't need a load of, but it's useful. So, this episode we're going to be working on the Sheep Coliseum. Yep, completely new, you've not seen this before, and I thought, yeah, I wanted a cool way of storing all my sheep. And this is how I decided to do it. So I've got colour-coded cells. Um, this last one would have, will, ha will have brown wool on the back, but I've only got two cocoa beans, so I can dye enough sheep to make more wool, but that'll have to wait. So, as 16 pens, it will store every colour wool, at least that I know of. Um, so yeah, all that will happen is you'll have sheep here, there'll be a pressure plate where I'm standing here, which I've got in my inventory now, and standing on the pressure plate will release water here, which will flow down. What will happen is there'll be a little walkway here that'll lead you up so that you can stand on the top over there and shear your sheep and then you come down stand the pressure plate and jobs are good and there'll be another iron bar here which will stop sheep escaping and I think I'm gonna have to put a block here for the time when I'm breeding them um, so yeah we're gonna wire up that so we're gonna start here um, first thing I need is that piston needs to be up and then I want to put that up there top here take this one up and go down there that's good oh I've gone, to the, I've gone the wrong way embarrassing I'm pretty sure actually that means I've gone the wrong side here Yep, my water's over here. Bums. Haha. Well, glad I got that sorted. Hmm, if you want, where's the wall? Where's the wall? Right, um. <laughs> Let's start again. Stick this down. Torch. And then we want redstone. Comes. Oh, I don't know. There we go. Redstone comes down here. Like that. That will get into that. Put all this. And we cover it with dirt. We come here and place pressure. Hey there guys, we're back and yep. Next objective is to move the sheep into it. So I waited till day and now I've got some wheat and we're gonna get some sheep now. So I think we're just gonna move them one pen at a time. Getting all four sheep come on. Don't ruin me here. Four sheep. I will punch you. Get it coming. Oh don't cause problems. There you go, come on. I don't need to pinch you, I'm just getting you out of your pen. Come on. Four, four sheep, four. Yep, yep, one more. You there. Come on, you there. Come on. Don't get stuck in a wall. Please. Right, there we go, four sheep. And now we're just gonna go over. I reckon what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put two sheep in each pen. Hopefully getting the right coloured sheep in, a, at least two of the right coloured sheep in the pens. So I don't have to dye everything. Um, but beyond that, all I do actually need is two sheep per pen. And, yeah. Come on, here, yeah, sheepy sheepy. So, I'm going to work on up the sets, which they're all going to struggle with, aren't they? Oh, there goes my phone, my bad. Come on, all four of you. 
Oh, it doesn't matter. I'll put two of you in a pen for now. Right, I think the red pen is right at the end. Oh, don't get stuck on the door. You made it up the stairs. There we go. Right. So, red pen, red pen. Do 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 do. There you go, red pen. Now what I want to do is actually I'm going to push you in. Oh, screw it. I'm just going to get in the pen and pull her out. Right, now I've got that. I'm actually going to stop, push you out, and no, get, get in the pen. <sighs> right, I'm going to have to block myself in when there's the right number of sheep. There you go. Now you can't get out. Now I have to do that. And now I've lost dirt and grass. Thanks, guys. Right. So I'll put you guys in the next one. Come in. Oh, don't you be stupid dirt sheep. Come on. Hello. Thank you. So there we go. Now I've got some sheep in the pen. Brilliant. Let's get some more. And yellow's next. And yep. I don't want to put sheep in the orange pen. Because I've already got one orange sheep. So that would just make things harder than it needs to be right at the start. So. Put that there. Oh, there you go. Shoot. Shoot all of you. No, I don't know what's behind me. Right. As you can probably tell, it actually took quite a bit of terraforming to get the area ready for that. I won't lose you. No, come on. Yeah. Um, I actually had to raise half of this and then sink the rest of it to get it all to this height. And I wanted it to be high up. So I want it to be like a Colosseum. It needs to be prominent. Um, although really, who it's prominent for is beyond me, because it's just me and I know what's in here. Oh, come on, I lost all of them on the stairs. Alright, I need to. Anyway, um... That's a sheep train. That's quite cool. We'll put some of you guys in here. I need to. As soon as I get two. Well done. Oh, you... Stupid, stupid sheep. Get in a pen. Faces in the bars. Go away. Ah. I may just kill you. No. Come on. I want you. Get out the bars. Not you. There you go. How was that so hard? Actually, because I've only got you here, I'll put you in the orange pen. And I'll actually block you off for now. Although I will need to come back and undo that. I guess actually we might as well now go and get the yellow sheep, the other yellow sheep, put them in. Oh, I've lost a sheep. Oh dear. How careless. Where are you sheep? No, well, we're going to go get the orange sheep now. Put the orange sheep in its pen. I don't get this with Minecraft. Orange sheep don't look very orange. Um... To me that's not an orange sheep. Here we come, come on. Oh, don't fall back in. 
<laughs> yeah. I think I'll probably speed this up and then see you guys when we do the dying of the wall. Let's grab that, you're gonna get a cut. I'll see you guys soon. Hey guys, right then, we're back in here and yep, I've got this front piece on. It looks quite cool, I quite like it. We've got a load of sheep in here now. Um, I've bred them so that I've got four in each pen. You notice I haven't got sheep in here. That's not because I'm missing sheep or I'm missing dye. It's because they're all in here. Because I ran out of sheep and thus have been breeding blue sheep for a very long time. Um, but yeah, I'm thinking more about the roof now. I reckon what I'll do is, instead of making this all wool, I'll try it with glass. And if glass doesn't work, I'll try making some kind of pattern or something like that, because that could be quite cool. Um, so yeah, this place is coming along really quite nicely. I've got my chests at the end with some wool that I've been harvesting from these guys um, continuously. And yeah, so what I now need to do is harvest sand, because I am running out. Um, I failed a bit. Um, we need to go this way. Right, um, yep, I failed a bit, and I've pretty much just run out. That's all I can say really, there's no more. I've got 25 sand I think. Yeah, so we're going to go to this desert that's down south. And yeah, we're going to go blow some of it up with TNT. And then, yeah. We're going to go get the rest of them with our nice efficiency for shovel. Which would be quite cool. It's in here. I've already been down here. Okay. Right, um... Yep, those of you who've watched previous episodes will know actually this is a very similar direction. Well, it's the same direction, because here's a dirt block I placed. Um, that I went last time when moving towards my new base. I went a lot further than this last time. I actually went through the desert that I'm going to now. I took a boat over the ocean and all that a bit ago. So, we will not be right there, but we will be going... Mm -hmm. And I'm going to try and cut around here so that I don't have to go through the water. Right, well, I will see you back at the desert. Well, guys, I just thought I'd give you a quick little update. Um, oh, I think that's something that I left up there a while ago. Anyway, um, yeah, I finally got here and I'd gotten distracted on the way. And instead of just getting here right on time, I got here just as it became night. So I quickly pull it up here. Um, wasted some sand that I found on the way, made some sandstone, and yep, yeah, I'm going to now wait till it's daytime again, because I was silly. So yeah, I will see you all then for some TNT experiments. Right then guys, we're back, and now we're going to start using some TNT. Yay. So, um, there's the edge, I can't really see it in this, yeah, so, take that down, run! And, yep, yeah, there we go. Nice and easy. Oh, that's a lot of sand. We've only got two TNT, so we'll have to be careful. I think I'll make the other hole far away from this one. There's no issue with accidentally joining into this hole. Because that would waste some of the blast. And then we'll dig round extra places later. Uh, this pick is so the shovel is so quick it's silly. Um, I often accidentally dig far too much, which I suppose when you're farming isn't an issue, but it isn't always what I want to do. So. you saw there, I'd, I'd literally just click. And this is so ridiculously quick. It's only three tall, but I'll save the pick. I realise I keep saying pick, I do mean shovel.
I don't really mind about disfiguring this um, desert. Because really what will happen is if I decide to do anything it will be far, far away. There aren't any villages anywhere or anything, so there isn't really much I can do. So yeah, I will use that. I will do a load of sanding and then I will meet you back at my base once we've started to cook this up. Right then guys, here we are again and now we've got all of that sand cooking away. I managed to farm over 10 stacks of um, sand, that was quite cool. That means now I've got loads of glass, um, 5 stacks should easily be enough anyway. Um, I'll just put away, I've gotten rid of half of a diamond shovel, so pretty excessive, but then I've got this silk touch pit if I do need to take everything down because I don't like it anyway. So yeah. Hey there guys, well we're back and I just thought I'd show you this before I started recording again. I was going to show you back when I'd finished putting the glass in the roof and I've now done that except I came down here to put another enchant on an item and I thought, show it, I thought I'd only show it to you because I've got this nice, nice axe and yeah, it's an iron axe with efficiency and silk touch. Um, what I need silk touch on an axe for is beyond me, but it's another tool with silk touch. So for things that need silk touch it's just as good as a pick. So I'll probably use that for getting glass and things if I don't like it, instead of my pick, because that can be used for ores. So, we'll just rock out here, and ta-da, it's still just as glorious at the front, and inside we've got this. I really quite like the glass at the moment, and um, that might change when I put the wall on at the other end, but at the moment I do quite like it, so what we'll do is we will just start to, um, yeah, get this going. So, I'll, I'll, I'm s <laughs> that is actually the very first time I've fallen off this wall while trying to build it, ever, which is quite an achievement at the moment, I think, because I tend to fall off things a lot, and that's sad. So, I will meet you all when this is done and dusted, because this is going to be very boring for you otherwise. See you all in a bit. Yeah, there goes. Right, I think this is time for us to finish off the episode. And I just thought I'd show you. It's now done. Um, I may have to put more torches here, and then mirror them here, because for some reason this side looks brighter. I suspect it's because the doors. Um, yeah, so basically we're done. I reasonably like this, um, but I may try and come up with some kind of mural thing. Um, it is eight, 8 down, and yeah, I may try and decide what I can do with the whole length of this using all the coloured wool that I'm getting. So, if I manage to find out, I will let you all know, and I'll see you guys next time where I'll probably look to expanding my pumpkin farm, you can see, just there. I'll see you guys around later. Enjoy mine around.